Hey, Shalom, all praises be unto Yahweh, Bashem Yahweh Shai, Bahasham Racha Kwadash, doubling unto the elder apostles and the elder bishops at Great Millstone, who are well, and he taught us his truth. Uh, salutes unto the 144,000 of the elect, and the rest of the elect also. Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, Barakadam. <coughs> and this article was sent to me here. Um, uh, by the, um, the elder Laban and. Um, it's to do with uh it's to do with um the the US government, you know, it's the US government that poses main threat to global economy. Uh the Ross Congress Foundation and it says after no sorry, according to the review, the debt surplus was accumulated at low rates and the need to refinance it occurred at high ones, which limit economic activity and reduce the cash flow on their end. Um, Moscow, January 10th, the national debt carried by the United States will pose the main threat to the global economy this year as current growth rates and budget dynamics make it impossible to pay off. You know, we all know about the... Uh, we all know about the debt clock you know, um, which is quite, you know, oh, is it quite high? It's an understatement. U.S. U.S. debt clock. <clears throat> so, look, this is the live figures. Or the US national debt, man. <laughs> you know, you can see the figures adjusting as we speak. So, um, it's pretty much, uh, it's pretty much, you know, unpayable, man. You know, so <laughs> that's why they want to do a financial reset because what. The coming of the chip also does it, it. It wipes away not only the current financial systems, but it wipes away the debt that is accumulated. Okay, and it says the U.S. government debt is the main threat to the world economy. Almost thirty-four trillion, and one trillion per year for service, threatened to destabilize the global financial system, it is mathematically impossible to pay off against. The current ratio of the U.S. national debt, its growth rate, and the evolution of budget revenue. So essentially, America's too far gone. Okay. You know, and um, if you look at, you know, you know, in depth, how the, the U.S. economy works, and you know, it's it's impossible. There's too many avenues too many debt bonds and it's just not going to work out it's, it's actually impossible you know as i said they're mathematically impossible because the, the system is set up to be built upon debt so you can't de-establish what your foundations are the foundations of america's debt you know and it worked up until it didn't <laughs> and now they ain't working no more you know and now the u.s economy is a threat you know, to the world economy, okay? And according to biblical prophecy, we know that America is, um, America is, uh, you know, numeral, numeral where it concerns prophecy, America is the, the point of focus, right? U.S. authorities will not be able to start the printing press again this year because the, this would lead to another found another round of inflation the f uh, foundation's analysis noted world congress views the elections in the u.s as the biggest uncertainty in 2024 with the worst case scenario being their non-recognition Foundation analysts also highlight the expected start of monetary policy of the US Federal Reserve, which will have a positive impact 
on the real economy and financial markets of the US and give a signal to the largest global regulators for uh, replication of such policy. You know? Um, so that's pretty much it, man. But, um, you know, the US debt is an issue, man. It's an issue. And, um, again, this is going to be a main reason as to why they want to bring that chip in, you know, to give themselves another chance, as it were. You know, um, go here to the book of um, Revelation chapter 13. Because that chip is going to be a way, a means of salvation also, man. Even for, you know, I say salvation, aka, you know, all the Abgeo. But even for them, man, it's going to be a, a fresh start. You know, the whole monetary system is, is going to go to, like, credit-based and limited, you know, um, limited spending allowances rather than work hard for your money and save as much as you can or spend what you want until the next paycheck. That whole system's going out. The, the thing, everyone's going to have set amounts they can even spend, man. Because that's what that's what's going to entail with this chip. Okay? Because they know their economy's fucked. Now, they'll say, yeah, minute growth here and there. But overall, man, the US is the number one uh, threat to, to bring down the world economy. You've got individual economies of countries, then you've got the world economy, man. You know? It's Revelation 13. Um... Verse 15, and it says, And he had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak, right, and cause, and his speaking is what, that his policies and plans, his new world orders, you know, the, the infrastructure, the plans behind it to pull it off, you know, Satan, you know, the um, false prophet, you know, is the spiritual side of the beast. You know, the Roman Catholic Church, you know, um, the military side in America, you know, you've got the financial bit which ties in with the UK. But um, that's what it is, man. Right? His image speaking is him executing his plans, man. And as would not, and as, and cause that as many as would not worship the image of the beast, aka, going, you know, those who go against the system, you know, anti chippers. You know, we're going to start killing people out here because they're going to be, through propaganda in, in the news outlets, they're going to be shown to be, what, anti, anti-progressive, anti man, as it were, to get rid of these people. And they're showing you these things in the Netflix shows whereby people are, you know, getting put to death, put, getting put in different groups, segregations, belief systems, schools of thought. Well, you don't subscribe to that? Okay, you, you're in that camp and then they end up executing you. That's why they've got these concentration camps out here, man. And he calls your fool, both small and great, rich on board for him, born to receive a mark in the right hand on their foreheads. Now we know that that word there in the Greek is karagma, the insertion, man. You know, so it's all leading towards the chip, right? Because you ain't going to have no debt clock. I mean, I took it off the screen now, but I showed you it. You're not going to have debt issues in the new financial system, man. So that's why they want to push that. But that just shows that America's going down, man. Um, the grinding shall see it, uh, uh, yeah, you know, these economies going down the pan, Ecclesiastes 12 and 3 in the day when the keepers of the house shall tremble, and the strong men shall bow themselves, and the grinding sees because they are few, and those that look out the window, they'll be darkened, man, so the keepers of the house are your economists, which really, Go all the way back up to your bank and elite families, you know, economics, like, uh, economia, in the Latin meaning what household management, you know. You know your your top your top, economists your top, elite banking families, man. You know. Economies going down, debt increase, and the payments becoming more impossible. You know these are all the things that's uh, happening. Out here, man, you know, it's twenty twenty four looking like a very volatile year. You know, will be a very volatile year for the U.S. economy, man. 
You know, it says the US government debt possesses main threat to global economy. <laughs> this is why these nations are, you know, they're doing other, you know, doing other deals, joining other, other making other alliances outside of, outside of America now, you know. Um, because what? You know, that's why you had the whole EU thing. You know, don't sleep on Brexit. People think, oh, Brexit was years ago. No, the effects of Brexit, you know, is about to be felt more than ever, man. You know, over in the UK and things of that nature, man. All right, so, um, 34 trillion. How the hell are you going to pay back 34 trillion? And it's really the debt clock, what they got out there, as I showed you. It's really more than that. It's probably like double, you know. You know, so these nations are looking on at America like, man, you're the fucking liability, you're the planet Earth, man. You know, and we're at the point where things aren't going to get drawn out anymore. You know, things are always happening. It's all going to shake up, man. And, uh, yeah, this is it. So even his own articles are bearing witness that his, his kingdom's on the way out, man. But like I said, you know, they already sent me this, you know, they were the brother, so, um, from the camp. You know, so I said, you know what, let me just, you know, catch on to this, you know. And we've we've, got, we've done videos like this before, and we're going to continue to do videos like this, man. You know, but, um, yeah, this, this is what it is, man. The US is kind of through. <laughs> and, um, you know, he's going to push forward his... His chip, he's going to push that chip, man. The main prophecy we're looking for now, you know, as we're in the beginning of Jacob's trouble, we're looking for the chip to come to pass, man. Keep your eyes on the mark of the beast, man. Okay? You know, and there's that amount, man. Shalom.